Here's how to make a lid for your round or cylindrical container. Start with a piece of cardboard and place your container upside down on the cardboard as close to an edge as possible. Use a pencil or a marker to trace around it. on the top of your box. Now you want to make a second layer with the lines of corrugation going the opposite direction. If I look at my two pieces of cardboard, I notice the lines are going in the same direction. So I want to rotate my cardboard so that the lines are going in the opposite direction. And I'll cut it out. With these two pieces cut out, it's time to glue them together. Be sure that you glue them with the corrugation going in opposite directions. You don't want your lid to warp when you're paper macheing it. The lid fits really nicely, but it will very easily fall off. So we need something to catch it on the inside so it doesn't just slide off. The easiest way to do that is to make a smaller version of these circles. We're going to trace them on our cardboard and we want to make another circle inside. The best way that I've found to do this without a compass is to take a finger and place it on the edge and draw a little dashed line. That way you can be sure you're staying the same distance away from the edge as you do your line. out on the solid line, I'm going to cut out the dashed line. I'm going to need a second one of these, and this cardboard is too small, so I'll need to find another piece. to glue these two together to each other and then to the inside of my lid. Try to keep it the same distance from all edges. You want it right in the center. Test to make sure it works. It is a little small but when you paper mache your box and your lid, it will get a little bit thicker and it will fit more snugly. Good luck making your rounded lids, folks.